hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Ronks and if you don't know now you know yeah it's been a while but welcome back to num video number two of 2022 um glad to be here i hope you are too i haven't really done a makeup tutorial before on my channel but i thought let's try something different you know and plus a couple of my friends um have asked me previously about um how i do my makeup without using the foundation i always tell them it's literally the same exact steps but literally just without the foundation you literally do the same thing exactly the same and but i don't know i just i just you know they just don't seem to understand what is there to not get so i thought i'll do a video explaining it and i thought you guys might benefit from that too so shout he shout Dion, yeah, this is for you. So yeah, without further ado, let's let's blow this popsicle stand. <laughs> that, that means just start let's start the um video. Yeah. Action. <laughs> So basically, first of all, I always start off by cleaning my face. Like, you should always start off, the first touch should always be cleaning your face because throughout the day, your face just oils up. Especially for me, I've got an oily face, so I've got a white, 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 clean, clean, clean. Make sure we start makeup on a fresh, clean slate, you know? And then, <laughs> this is me trying to... <laughs> I'm new to this, y'all, okay? I'm new to this. But I'm basically, I'm basically moisturizing my face. I use vitamin E um, face cream from Body Shop. I'll put the descriptions below. Next thing, we've got to go in with our spoolie to brush out the eyebrows. You know, make sure they're in the right shape. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is upside down, but this <laughs> this is the got to be um, eyebrow and edges um, gel. Like I said, descriptions down below. I probably forgot. I probably got that name wrong. I don't know. And then, of course, you gotta let it dry, 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 dry. You know what I mean? <laughs> I swear down, there is no time I'm doing makeup that I'm not eating. And I actually don't know how to open a banana, that's why I opened it. <laughs> that's why I opened it like that, but yeah. <laughs> what am I doing? It's it, whatever, enjoy yourself, rocks, man. Enjoy yourself, rocks. Okay, now, so I'm just filling in my eyebrows. I always start off from the bottom. Obviously, everyone does this um, differently. You just do what's best for you. I find it easier to do this way so I can get the shape right from the start. Um, I find it easier to do also after I use the Got To Be Gel because it's not, it doesn't come out as harsh. Now I'm about to um, shape my eyebrows properly with concealer from LA Pro Girl. LA Girl Pro, what's it called? <laughs> I use the shade Chestnut and um, the concealer. I use that all over my face, by the way. So this is the same concealer I use throughout. <laughs> I forgot to use primer, guys. So I use Milk. I'm kind of testing this out at the moment to see if it's better than my other primers that I used to use. I'll let you guys know later on if I do another makeup story, but right now this is just a test. But so far, so good. Yeah, so now back to shaping the eyebrows. So with my eyebrows, depending on how well I drew them from the start, I literally just follow the shape of the eyebrows and just um, pull the eyebrows down. I'm um, not pull the eyebrows, pull the concealer down. Yeah. Yeah, literally the eyebrows are looking very mad at the moment, but don't worry, don't worry. We're gonna blend it out. We're gonna blend it out. <laughs> And here we are. Literally, the key to good makeup is learning how to blend. You gotta blend at every stage, literally every step of the way. Just blend, 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 and blend. Yeah. Yeah, so I like to put concealer on my eyelids just so we have an even tone all round. <laughs> Why did I come up like that? <laughs> yeah, I use this, I like to use a small brush as well when I use concealer so I have more control of um, how it blends. And see? See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? You see the difference, y'all? Even after I do it, I still like to blend out. You still gotta blend, guys, don't forget, okay? Yeah, can't forget to vest in your lips, guys. <laughs> I 
Okay, so at this stage, this is when I start putting concealer all over my face. This obviously depends on what your shape and your, your head size, all that, what your face is like, basically. So don't just follow the kind of shape or how I drew um, my concealer on my face here. Just follow your face, you know, where the light hits, it obviously depends on what your face is like. And here we go, blend now again with my um, small brush. See how easy it is to blend around the eyebrows with the um, smaller brushes. You also need to be careful around um, the crease of your eyes as well. Try not to put too much concealer there or it will probably crease. Here we go again with the blending. <laughs> Oh, I didn't show this, but I use, um, I'm using setting powder at the moment. I use Sasha Buttercup. I'm not sure if they do shades in Sasha Buttercup, but if they do, I'll put it in the description below. We're getting better at this um, showing stuff. We are now going in with a concealer. I use Fenty um, concealer in the shade Ebony. <laughs> I find it so much easier to draw concealer when you suck your, um, is it your cheeks in like that so you can see the contour of your natural face. Like I said, blend, blend, blend. I'm being very precise by using a small brush here, but normally I just use the same big brush as I did earlier. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I don't know what that was, but I'll be singing a lot when I do my uh, makeup. <laughs> oh no, what song is this? Yeah, that went half bad. That was all right. That was cute. <laughs> but yeah, here I am going in again, blending, making sure the concealer is blending well with the contour, you know. <laughs> Killing with the shoulders. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is the MAC Mineralizing um, Powder. And I basically... <laughs> what am I doing? I basically just use it to help blend everything together. It's like a natural skin tone. <laughs> oh my gosh. So now I'm going in with my fancy bronzer in shade, this is upside down, <laughs> in shade Mokamami. <laughs> so I literally just put that all over the areas that I contoured earlier to kind of bronze up my face, you know, add some colour, you know. So I mean, I could have used a smaller brush on my nose there, but I was being lazy. I was being lazy. But yeah, you see the difference bronzer makes? Now the face is just shining, it's glowing, it's, you know, everything's just coming together. Once again, we blend, you know? I don't even need to say this anymore. You guys know what it is. So yeah, I'm literally just going with the bronzer again to kind of warm up the rest of my face to make sure everything fits well. I take it down to my neck as well. You know, you don't want to be one of those people where your face doesn't match your neck and it's just like two whole different shades. You don't want that. <laughs> oh, look at us. I was so happy because I got this right. Um, I've been using this Morphe setting spray for some months now and I really like it. It's like a setting mist. It's not heavy. It, I, don't know, I really feel like it helps my foundation last. Highly recommend. <laughs> yeah. Now we wait for it to dry. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I wonder what song I was listening to here. Okay, so now I'm going to go with some eyebrow pencil. You know, just you guys know how to start. I don't really need to explain that. No, <laughs> not the broken nail. Yeah, any mascara is literally fine. I don't know which mascara this is, but like I said, description below. Look how much difference mascara makes. Who would have thought? Yeah, so I don't really use lip liner too often. I just use my eyebrow pencil, but you know, it does the same job, guys. It actually does the same job. And just like with your face, don't forget to blend your lips too. Blend, blend, blend. For this look, I use two different lip liners, as you can see. This one's a bit more redder. 
I love this lip gloss. Like, I love how it looks. I've been using this brand for actually like five years now and they have not disappointed. I love it so much. Look how my lips are just shining. Yeah, can't forget to take a selfie. Um, shout out on my B on Instagram for these braids. I've had them in for over a month now and they're still kind of fumble. Like, even though my new growth is growing or whatever, it's still there. It's still there. But shout out on my B for her on Instagram. And does she have anything else? TikTok as well. I'll put all her details below.